a smaller am i recording <laughs> Greetings Earthlings and welcome back. It's been three weeks since I've made a YouTube video, which is a really, really long time. I went on my honeymoon, um, me and my husband went to Panama for two weeks, and then after we got back, I wanted to just kind of um, take that week and kind of get the kids back into our routine and kind of just get back in the swing of things, back to reality. Things are going great, my hair is growing, um, I've been working out, like hardcore eating, healthy and life is good. How are you guys? How is the new year so far? Leave a comment down below, let me know. So today I'm going to be sharing my thoughts on Maybelline's new Master Contour Kit. I actually picked up Rimmel's little contour highlight blush kit and um, L'Oreal also has a contour kit. So I will be doing a review on these very, very soon. I have it on right now. I purchased this for about 12 bucks, and they're all labeled contour blush and highlight. You're paying $4 for a contour powder, $4 for a blush, and $4 for a highlight, if you think about it. Oh, it came with this little brush, which I know a lot of people are like, well, I don't know what I'm doing. Blah, 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 blah. A lot of people are just like tossing this little brush. Don't toss this little brush, you guys. You can use this for the highlight pick up a little bit of highlight. You can do the cupid's bow because it fits perfectly right there. You can even tap your highlight on right here for like a subtle effect, you know? Don't toss this, you could use it. I wouldn't use it for contouring or blush, but for the highlight, use it. All three of these have great pigmentation. I did get the light kit. I do feel like the contour shade is a little bit warmer than what I would typically go for. So let me show you a swatch of Shadow Play, which is the contour color in the Shade and Light Light Kit from Kat Von D. I'm going to swatch that above so you can see. See how cool this is? This is what I typically contour with. So this is a lot warmer and orangey than I prefer. See the difference there. I will use this as a bronzer. I won't be contouring with it because it is too warm. Some people are okay with warmer shades to contour with. I am super fair and it just doesn't look right. So I will, yeah, not be using it as a contour. The blush, I love the blush. I will probably end up hitting pan on this blush and I will probably end up hitting pan on the highlight because I am just a huge fan of both of these. They're super gorgeous. Um, like I said, super pigmented goes on smooth. For 12 bucks, I say pick it up, even if it's just for the blush and the highlight. You can even use this contour powder, like I said, for a bronzer or even for eyeshadow. I'm wearing it in my crease today and I absolutely love it. down below just to help other viewers out and don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you think it deserves a thumbs up and follow me on all my social networks I'll leave the links down below <laughs> and I'll see you guys later peace